Right. Let's just see, shall we? Let's check this works. There we go, we're all good. Right. It's that time again. I know it was a bit delayed, but I was watching Money in the Bank, so. <laughs> right, who have we got in the stream then? Ross, you get the gold. Uh, Harry, you get the silver. Ozzy, you get the bronze. Good to have all of you. Jack Smith, welcome to the stream as well. Um, yeah, so we're going to be starting on the exterior of the Sir Bobby Charlton stand today. What is money in the bank? WWE wrestling. First wrestling event I've watched for crikey years. <laughs> Uh, Fred, welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Uh, MFJ, welcome. Yeah, so this is where we're at. The corners are structurally done, more or less, on two sides. So I spent most of yesterday doing these. So we've got the southwest and the southeast in, which means I can now start the back end of the Sir Bobby Charlton. Uh, Bolton's away kit, yeah, it's black. I mean, there's literally no chance that we're going to get relegated, so that's a plus. I mean, I would have preferred green, but you can't get everything in life. Alright, just need to sort that out. Lovely. Alright, so I think the best strategy in terms of where I can get pictures, is probably to go from southeast to southwest. That seems like the best course of action, I think. Because somehow I managed, I managed to find pictures of the Munich Tunnel. And at Street View, so that's even better. Right. Let's crack on then, so that I'm not wasting any more time. Maybe third would be green. Well, the way that it works was that the fans got to vote on the home and the away kits, and then apparently the third one's going to be charity based, and the club will choose that. I mean, if the club end up choosing green as well, then yeah, it's sort of pointless then, wouldn't it? Right. So. This bit here just goes in between these two sort of trusses and then we can build out. Fantastic. Uh, next week is the Rugby Championship which is Australia, New Zealand, Argentina and South Africa. Very nice. I mean I don't watch rugby but yeah very nice. Uh, tough sheet for the fans if it isn't. <laughs> Very true, very true. Yeah, if you missed the post that I put out earlier on, I managed to get one of the stands done on the DW, so the north stand's now fully detailed and, well, finished. So it just means I've got three stands left. Question is, do I do a final day stream for that? Hmm. Very interesting. Right. So I think if I'm right. Yep. Yeah, so that just goes across there and then outwards. So it's simple enough. It's just what you call a transitional segment. Um, will you do the changing rooms on this ground? If I can get pictures of them, I will do them. I have got the tunnel more or less in place, but it's got no detail into it. I couldn't see what was inside the tunnel. But I do know that it doubles as... Uh, Emergency access. Do 
It doubles as emergency access because the old tunnel is obviously no longer used. Um, I'm not looking forward to later. I've got a 10 hour drive back home from the Gold Coast. Crikey. That's going to be some trek for you. Um, I can send you some pips if you want. Yeah, that would be grand if you can. Um, I think a final day stream would be good. Never been to one before. But in that case, it's something I'll look at doing. Like, I think when I've... The, the point of a final day stream is... It get... It, like, the way it works is that if I feel I can have a stadium finished in a 10 hour period, then I stream those final 10 hours. The reason I set the 10 hour limit is because of what happened when I did Villa Park. Whereby I went for 13 hours and it didn't render 2 hours. In fact it didn't render 3 actually. Because YouTube stops at 10 for some reason. Um, I can hear myself again, damn it. Um, you could put a post if people want a final day stream. Yeah, I can do. Alright, let's see. Start this down to the bottom. Yeah, as I say, these corners I spent a good portion of yesterday trying to get them structurally ready. And that included putting all this stonework in as well. Because the pitch at Old Trafford is not at ground level. Um, Future Armour returning this month, but as like other shows, it's streaming only. I think everything's going streaming nowadays, isn't it? Uh, I can't actually see that bit. It looks like... Let's see... Looks like it goes from about here. A little bit further over, actually. Uh, I went and watched that and thought it was weird how it stro stopped abruptly. Yeah. I didn't realise until after I'd obviously put it up. So I went back to watch some of it myself and then it just cut off at like 11 hours 55 I think. Which was a bit annoying. Um, it's going to be on that Hulu and I don't think we can get it in the UK. Maybe Disney Plus. Well I know we can get Disney Plus in the UK. I wouldn't fork out for it though. I think it's a rip off. Alright, let's see. Stack 12 up. 16 maybe. Nah. 17, but might as well fill that in. Again, the only thing with these final day streams is that the only sort of advisable time to do them is on a weekend. So they'd be on a Saturday if I was going to do them.
Alright, so we can bin that off. And then we can start actually doing the rest of the exterior. Stuff like doors and turnstiles and everything I can add at a later date. It's not really that essential at the minute. Right, let's see. How wide do I want to make that? So let's see, what would that be? That would be... That's about four blocks, I think. It's like a little stone sort of segment here. Um, I wonder how long it would take to build Old Wembley on bedrock. I can't possibly imagine. The size of it, doing a curve, or doing an oval rather, because that's what the Old Wembley was. Oh, talking a good few years. Uh, will I build Wembley? I do want to one day. Right, how tall is that? In fact, I didn't even need to do that. So we've got the two for that, and then probably another three above that. Two, one, two, three. In fact, that lines up with where this bit is, so... That all makes sense, that's good. I've just seen Harry sent the pictures through. I'll take a look at them later on tonight when I get a chance. Right, so... For the actual tunnel itself... I'm thinking that's probably the another four. So I think if I do it in the colour of the roof that would make sense. So we've got four there. In the middle of that, that's probably either eight or nine. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then another four on the other side. That's not too wide, is it? That's about right. And then the wall's on that side, so that's absolutely fine. That's good. Um, I've had it in my mind to build the old Wembley at some point as well as Hampton. That's fair enough. I mean, either one's going to be particularly difficult, whichever one you choose to do. It's probably better actually if I do like the doors and stuff. Actually, no, no, I'll, I'll do what I was doing. Um, Elon Musk is trying to make people buy Twitter blue, bro. I'm getting limited to reading 600 tweets per day. Everybody's doing it. Like, everybody is getting limited to 600 tweets a day. I don't know why. I mean, people are just going to end up choosing different platforms instead. I mean, I'm not going to get Twitter blue. Why would I? <laughs> um... And since they both have slash had circular ends, yeah, of course, the new Wembley doesn't have a circular end anymore. Right, this actually goes around that corner, so I need 
loot from the other end. So the end of the tunnel's there. So it's it's actually more or less where the end of that is, and I did that last night. Um, when we finish the whole ground, it's going to be a long while yet. The size of the ground, I mean, this would be by far the biggest ground that I've ever built. I mean, it's what, 75,000 seat, 75, seater? My current biggest is the Etihad, which is about 54. So, yeah, it's going to be a while before Old Trafford's finished. Um, you already know about my plant map. Yeah, I do. <laughs> so, being on Xbox is bad enough. Um, I'll try and pop in again once I get on the road. Just finished packing, not a problem. Uh, Will, welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Uh, the Twitter is over. Party is about to start. Yeah, I might actually start using Facebook again. That would be a first. I mean, I'll be sticking on using Instagram. That's not going to change. Right, so the tunnel is here. So if I was to line that up with this, that would be about here. I think 343 sort of works better for that setup. Um, Etihad is due to get another expansion when the other side gets done. It is indeed. And I will be adding it. Like when they start building it, I'll try and keep track of where they're at with it and then I'll try and follow it step by step. But of course, before that, there's. Um, what's it called? Co op live. The end of the tunnel would actually be there. So it's one, two, three. Two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three. Smart idea. Well, it's how I did the like the so stand expansion. I went through and found pictures. That people took of it while it was being built and then I used that to try and put in every single element in the right place it turned out alright in the end actually Ideally, I need to work out how wide that is, but obviously I'll work that out doing this at the same time. Um, evening. Welcome to the stream, Max. Good to have you. Right, so roughly I need to try and work out how wide that is. Actually, I might be better off doing it from this side. So that's, that might be a five. So if we go four, one, two, three, one, two, three, Can I see the inside real quick before you carry on building? Yeah, not a problem. 
I can't actually remember why I put the roof over in that corner because it's not going to be there when I finish it. But so far at the minute, this is what I've got. And the plan, obviously, is to finish Sir Bobby Charlton, then move over to the Alex Ferguson, then do the Stretford end, and then finish with the East Stand. That's the plan. But it is going to take a while. Eight up. Should have done that by ten, actually. Um, let us see the tunnel. It's got nothing in it. All I've done is just map out where it's going and then I've just used the default like brick texture that I used on the outside. So this is all I've done for the tunnel. Once I'm able to properly detail it, I will. Um, you must be building it how it was in the early 90s. Well... I did a, a little bit of research on that and the way that Old Trafford has been built a lot of the old exterior is actually still there and I think I can demonstrate with if I find let's see so this is I think near the Sir Alex Ferguson but all of these turnstiles and stuff are from the old exterior so what they've done is just kept all the old stuff and then built out built out and over the top so much of what was there in the 90s is still there which is why at some point I did toy with the idea of building the old exterior and then just adding to it but I thought it would be too time consuming if I did that Uh, before it became a rat infested theatre of screams. <laughs> Very true. Yeah, the reason why I went like looking underneath the stands is because I've seen obviously like when people have been doing Old Trafford beforehand they tend to leave the undersides sort of blank so that's why I thought it might be an idea to see where the turnstiles are and I think I can actually show you with the Stretford end I think that was probably a better example that I could have showed you so if we go round here to the Stretford end You'll be able to better see that the outside carries on underneath. So all of this is the original exterior that was there. And then the, again, they've just built and added onto it. So I will have to do all of that. But that is where the turnstiles are. So all they've done is just stuck the additional tiers on top of what was there. And yet a lot of people seem to miss that when they build Old Trafford for some reason. Um, part 1 would be early Premier League era. Part 2 would be the first expansions. Or if we're going first expansions, the first one I'd be adding would be Sir Alex Ferguson. <laughs> uh, part 3 would be how it is now. Yeah, I suppose. Ah, I didn't want break. So yeah, so I'll be doing the Alex Ferguson, then the Stretford End, then the East Stand, and then finally fill the quadrants. Because that seems to be the easier way to do it. 
as opposed to trying to build the whole stadium as it is now in one go. Uh, when they built it, they say they time saved themselves. They did. I think the only stand that got completely demolished was the Sir Alex Ferguson stand from pictures that I've seen. They demolished the whole thing and then rebuilt it, but I think the other two, they just built on what was already there. And I've already done that slightly wrong. Uh, Stratford, Stratford, then they demolished it. No, I don't think they did. They might have done when they had, like when they had to convert it to an all seater. They might have done, but when it came to expanding it, they just built on what was there. I've just put that back in place, haven't I? <laughs> Oh, balls that up quite badly. I've actually confused myself. What have I actually done here? That's a four. That should be a three. There we go. Uh, got get confused by the 92-ish pick. Yeah. I can only presume that they would have had to demolish quite a lot of it if they were going to be like converting it to an all-seater. But in terms of the expansions themselves, it was largely left untouched. That's better. But I still, I still don't get why a lot of people have missed that out whenever they've tried building Old Trafford. Thanks for reminding me, Harry. <laughs> um, when you do Tottenham, can you do the tunnel and NFL pitch in the car park? I don't know where the car park is at Tottenham. But the NFL, like, I could probably do two versions for uh, the Tottenham one. So I could do one with the NFL pitch and one with the... Like, one with the actual football pitch. Car park, I think, is under the stadium. Right, okay. That makes sense, actually. Right, I need to get this corner sort of spot on. Because otherwise it will affect the rest of it. So what I need to do is work out the distance between that wall and where the outer wall is going to be. Uh, the NFL pitch is lower than the Premier League pitch. I know that part. <laughs> yeah, the, the NFL pitch is more or less the permanent surface and then they put the football one on top. Right, let's see. So it's 3, 7, 10, 14... 17, 21, 24, 28, 32, 35. Just got confused then because I put that one in the wrong part. Wrong part. So, right, so it's 35 out. Uh, Say oh, 
And then I think the outer one was one four three. That that outer red ring that I've got. I think that was one hundred and forty three blocks. That is one hundred and forty three. So it's not 143 plus 35, it's I think it's at 139. Actually no it's not. Um there's a documentary by Richard Hammond that goes into detail about it. I've watched that documentary. I thought it was pretty good actually. Uh, right, so it's E, I think it's a 133. And then that's where the outer wall is. Could be wrong. Oh, no, I'm right. Right, so it's 133 plus 35. So that's 168. Coronation Street, <laughs> Railway Road. Yeah, it's Railway Road. Um, I'm currently doing the new Lawn Stadium, home of Forest Green Rovers. I think Phantom's done that. Might be worth checking his out. Oh, hang on. Three, seven, ten, fourteen, seventeen, twenty-one, twenty-four, twenty-eight, thirty-one, thirty-five. That is thirty-five. So why is that like that? That's not right. That's not good. That's not right. Uh, don't expect me to visit France anytime soon. To be fair, I'd rather go anywhere but France. Oh, cock. Should have been 170, shouldn't it? I'd rather go to... I'd rather go to Greece than France. Provided they're not still broke. Um... One seventy. That's Bob on that. Actually, that was the one I was supposed to be looking at. <laughs> and then that ends straight, so that's fine. And Wigan. Well, yeah, there's always that. Right, it's ironic, I'm streaming and yeah, I'm listening to the architects. No, I do not mean myself. <laughs> Have you hit 100 requests yet? Uh, no, I have not. I can't actually remember what I'm on. I think I'm on like 88. Let's have a look, shall we? That was slow as anything. Yeah, we're on 88. 
So once I get to 100, then I'm not accepting any new requests. Uh, can you add a old stadium high field road? I'm surprised that wasn't requested before, to be honest. I thought with people asking me to do the recall that someone would have asked to do Highfield Road, but apparently not. On request. I'll just add that onto the other end. Lovely stuff. Right. Sure, Reese is doing high field as well. He was at one point. I don't know what happened to it though. Oh, the phone. That's not even straight. at a weird angle. Thought it might be. Right. So that begs the question, am I missing one of the trusses? Right, so find the middle. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then it's on the ninth one. So how many have I got there? Right. So let's just double check that. So take it from there. Three, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, there's a ninth one there because that edge is not straight. So it's three, six, eight. So there should be another one in there. Unless, of course, that entire roof setup's wrong. Oh dear. Hmm. So that's three. I need to double check this because I might have an issue. Right, so from there, that's three, six, seven, eight. That eighth one's right up against there. Because I thought that the roof on this was identical, but I don't think it is. Three, that's only six, so that roof's got to be redone, I think. That's where I'm leaning. Well, that's not good. So that would, yeah, I'm gonna have to completely redo that corner. So this bit of the roof, or this bit of the south stand exterior, I cannot do for the time being because that entire corner is going to have to be redone. And this is why copy and paste is not always ideal. Um, we need more retro builds for sure, oh definitely. Uh, but people usually go for the bigger, more known stadiums because it makes in more views. That's precisely it. Um, which is sad because other smaller clubs aren't gaining recognition. Luke doing Amiens is one of those rare stadiums to build, especially a small French one. Very true. Yeah, we do. We do need more retro builds. I think it's a shame that you don't get more of them. Right. 
I think I am right. That entire cut, the roof and outer wall on that corner is going to have to be redone. Because I thought they were identical and they're not. One's got six trusses, one has got eight. Which is slightly annoying. But hey, this is why I don't do tutorials. <laughs> Alright, so if I find the eighth one on here, then I can use it as a boundary. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's. I can do up to here. This is a tutorial. Well, kind of, but with a heck of a lot of trial and error. I mean, nobody said stadium building was easy. Especially on this sort of scale where even the slightest mistake can cost you. Right. So on this one, actually, oh. right. If I do that out to wall up to where that sort of truss is, oh shit! A tutorial on swearing. <laughs> Won't catch me doing that on YouTube. And no, I do not count cock as swearing. <laughs> I mean, where I'm from, it's used as a greeting. Remember, my dad always used to say it to our neighbours when I was growing up. So this one's up to this truss here. Let's uh, bin that off. Six. YouTube begs to differ, even Susan. Who's Susan? <laughs> uh, one my dad uses is alright, Cocker. Yeah, that's one that she used around here as well. You're alright, Cock. You Lancashire folk your own breed. <laughs> yeah, we're the only people in the country who think eating a pasty in a barm is normal. Start at two hundred. Yeah, we'll work with it. Love a pasty. Hey, Jacob, welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Uh, that's just Wigan. No, they eat pies. They stick pies in barms. And they call it Wigan Kebab. But we invented pasty bams in the 50s. Apparently it was in, was the tale goes that 
a couple of students came home on a lunch break from school and they didn't have enough time to get anything so they just got a pasty and stuck it in a bam and then it became a local Bolton delicacy. One of those and you're literally full for the rest of the day. Um, one, two, three. Nothing is normal in Wigan, very true. I mean, nobody eats a pie in, in a bam, because that is not normal. Oh, cocky Nora. I wonder why that was too short. Uh, I was only in Wigan for like five minutes straight out of it. <laughs> That's more or less me when I'm on my way home from my mum's. Because I have to change trains at Wigan. Um, how's Old Trafford going? Um, not too bad for the most part. I'll show you what I have in a minute. But long story short, I'm going to have to demolish the roof on one of the corners and completely redo it. Wonder what will bug me then. Uh, very strange place. Even though I only saw it for a train window, that's lucky. <laughs> right. So what I've got so far is obviously the main, like the stands on the lower bit are done. Um, I spent most of yesterday doing that corner, the southwest. And then, thinking they were exactly the same, I copied the top half of that over to this side, southeast. However, and that's despite the fact that I've also done a lot of the exterior on this now, when it came to doing this, I've realised that the roof over that corner is wrong. It should have eight trusses, whereas I've only given it six. No, I do not plan on doing all of that on stream. <laughs> I've already done a stream before where I've had to spend the entire time demolishing something. I don't plan on doing it again. So that's that one there. And then I think it's going to have to be one, two, three, one, two, three. So I'd say seven. Two, three. Although it's not wider than those two, is it? So. Go for a five as opposed to a seven. Uh, Wigan, wasn't it, Matt? Yes, it was. <laughs> 
if I know something's going to get demolished, I don't want to bore you all to death with it, so that's why I don't want to do it on a stream. But that's also why I will not do official tutorials. Right, so that's that one. That probably comes up to about there, maybe. Six, nine, twelve. Six. Um. Oh, wrong one. Don't want to press that. You cursing off stream, you mean? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so the next one, one, two, three, four. So it's one, two, three, four. I'm not liking the way this is going. I don't know why, but I'm not liking how this is going. Uh, if only we streamed our Discord calls, broke all the rules with those. <laughs> yeah, that was the one time where rules went out the window. Right, so that really should be... From there to there. One comes over to the next one. No, oh, you tool, not that. There we go. When I said that there was an issue with the roof over that corner, I'm beginning to think it was both sides.
My outside is bang on. Brilliant, that's good to know. Yeah, I'm beginning to think I might have a serious issue here. Three bits there. I only have two. And that's that's one, two, but then I end up with a massive gap here, so Extensive rebuild, probably not quite extensive, but it's going to take some work. Because if I have that lined up where it's meant to be, which is where I've got it now, then that needs to move over by one, but if I do that, then the gap in the middle there is wrong. So... I don't know. And there goes me from the from last night saying that this was basically an easy build. Why do I always drop myself in it? <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's see if I can sort of redeem it. Alright, so one, two, three, and then on that one there, there's a small column. One, two, three. Yeah, one, two, three, and then on the fourth one. It might mean the trusses themselves might need realigning. Oh, for crying out loud. Right, so that's where it should be. And it's a gap of one, and then three fifths. <laughs> So that's one. Three fifths, because it's about here. It's not quite halfway. And then that spans over to the next one, which is there. Which ends up being the last one. Right, well the ones in the the one in the middle is obviously spot on because it's gotta be right above where the halfway line is. So that one doesn't need moving. I get the sense the rest of them might need move. Well, probably will need moving. So that's fine. Where's Matt the German tonight? Stay in it. Um. I don't actually know what I'm going to do. Let's 
see if I can use the seat and plan as a guide. Oh, so I'm presuming this bit here is the end of the roof. So how many is that from centre? So that's centre, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's right. But it can't be. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. I'm really confused. Oh, God. That's just annoying. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's where the seventh is. So that must mean. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Sorry if this is sounding a bit boring, but I just need to get this right. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Have I got a... It might be worth, if I put these in, then that might give me a better idea as to where the missing truss is. So if I do that... Do that and then I might work it out. If not, I'm screwed. Because something is not right. Right, so at the top of this... It's eight, it's eight. Let's get rid of this. Sounds a good plan. Well, I can't really think of any other at the minute. I'm just thinking if I do it like this, then I might... It might sort of... Give me a bit of an idea. I've gone wrong somewhere, I know I have. Because otherwise that would add up. And it doesn't. Two above the seats. What the hell? What have I actually done here? Three, nine, ten. Three, six, nine, ten. 
So why does then that why doesn't that add up? Oh god I actually don't know what I've done. So that I'm beginning to think this might be worse than I thought. Something's massively wrong. That should line up with the back of this, but for some reason it doesn't. So you've got the ten seats, ten rolls there, and then the top two are blank. Or top one and a bit. Oh, I'm not liking this. So if I start at the bottom and work up, just check it all adds up. Three, six, nine, eleven up to that red line. Three, six, nine, eleven. So that adds up, that's fine. Uh, a day in the life of the experienced MC builder, indeed. This is what this is what I was pretty much doing most of yesterday. <laughs> Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty one, twenty four, twenty seven, thirty, thirty three, thirty four. And that's from here. Three, six. 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30, 33, 34, yeah. This is really puzzling. And all of a sudden I can hear Fairy Tale of New York from my dad's TV. <laughs> five, so it's five for that. So that's one, yeah, one, two, three, four, five. So that's not too big. So that's got the exact number of rolls it should have. Or does it? Right, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty one, twenty four, twenty seven, thirty. Right, three, six, nine. 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30. So that's right. I actually don't know what I've done.
I genuinely do not know what I've done. We've all got the right number of seats. This is right, but that's right as well, and yet for some reason it doesn't feel like it is. I honestly don't know where I've gone wrong. Eight, so that's right. I might have to improvise, which is something I don't normally want to do. But at this point, I don't think we've got much other choice. So we've got a uh, glass window on that, that takes up to there. Hold the phone. Oh, now I know what I've done. <laughs> I completely missed the truss out, that's what I've done. Because this one's right in the middle of this, and yet, if I go back to mine, there's no truss in the middle. I've worked out what I've done, I can progress! Huzzah! I've sussed it. Jawohl. Right, let's just see where that lines up then. up with a third in the third or fourth seat so it lines up here that's where the missing truss is oh I'm an idiot so it might not be as drastic rebuild as I first thought it was going to be. All I can say there is catastrophe averted. Uh, I'll celebrate with some lettuce now it's sussed. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'm bleeding. I'm absolutely glad that I've worked that out. Otherwise that could have been absolutely horrific.
Uh, that could have been really bad. So it's lucky I've worked that out. Sake. I'm kind of on a health kick, so I got to be good. I wish I could say the same. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not in exactly what you call good shape right now. So three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. Six, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. If this was the glazers, they'd be like, ah, oh, sod it, yeah. They just let it fall into disrepair. It, or more importantly, they would give up. And that's something I've got no intention of doing.
I mean, truth be told, I did not want to have to do all of that again. So I just need to copy that other, well that new truss rather, over to the other side. And then we're back on track. I think you would have gone ape crap if you did. Yeah. I'd have lost my shizzle. <laughs> Need to get that bit of a curve going. That's a straight wall. It's a straight wall, isn't it? Shizzle in the Trafford. <laughs> Very true. I mean, it does mean that I need to do this little bit again but it's not as wholesale in terms of changes as I thought it was going to end up being so all I can say is thank Christ for that right so now I need to rearrange these make sure they're all in the right place and then we're all good Right, I'll start in the middle and work out because that's probably the easier way of working out if it's right. I mean, the scenes, if I've done all this and then work out, is still wrong. <laughs> right. First things first, I'll get rid of what I put down earlier. If you've just rejoined the stream, I finally sussed it. I hope. <laughs> right, one, two, three, four, and then that's where that bit is. Oh, please let this be right. One, two, three, four, so that needs moving. Uh, 
14, isn't it? So it lines up there. And then from there it should be 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Ha ha! Huzzah! I'm invincible! Um, messaged my dad an hour ago, get your credit card on standby for me and his reply was depends if you bet on Leeds getting promoted. <laughs> yeah, I'm not entirely sure what the odds of that are. the other way one two three and then a the little bit that stands out so one two three the yeah that's correct and it's the one one fifth so that should be over by one two three That's right. That means the end of the route, end of the stand itself is here. That is all present and correct. Thank Christ for that. <laughs> John Cena was talking Wrestlemania could be heading to London it's about bleeding time um, so that better sort me out or there'd be trouble <laughs> well obviously it won't be next year because Wrestlemania 40 is going to be in Philadelphia so Wrestlemania 41 maybe I mean I'd definitely be up for going sod work they can sod off <laughs> Right. So now it's just work. Well, now that I've got that in at least, it's just working out the bits in between. Well, it'll probably be easier if I do the ton like because I don't think there's any interiors I'll be able to do on this stand. So it's just a case of getting the Munich tunnel to its full length. And then going from there. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. The backing of that stand is bloody strange. Yeah, it's definitely something out of the eighties. Yeah, that's what I mean about the old exterior. I 
can only imagine that that exterior was put on when they initially rebuilt that stand. That's all I can think of. It's very 70s. By that I mean it's very brown. <laughs> If it's brown, beige or white, it probably came out of the 1970s. Uh, right. I've just realised that these bits cut in as well, so... Let's see what we can do with that. three an inset of three art deco no it's not quite art deco art deco is very 1930s think art deco you think like the Chrysler building well I was reading that apparently they're bringing uh, like they're doing a skyscraper in New York but they're trying to revive like the sort of art deco method that was very common of the 1920s and 30s but the building that they've designed looks absolutely horrible. It's like Art Deco in today's New York just does not work. Because they've done it like where it steps back. Because that was very typical of skyscrapers in that age. Because they had to let more light down to street level. But the way they've done it in the modern period just doesn't work. It looks horrible. I mean, I could probably show you. Right, so I need to divide this into... I need to divide it into thirds. So you've got the top bit, middle, bottom. At least all the bottom of it's brick. Lovely. Um... So that's 37, so that's 30, that's 39 up to the roof, isn't it? Is it 39 up to the roof? So that's 38, yeah, so it's 39. 39, so 13, 13 by 3. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. There we go, that should work. Crazy. I'll try and find that building for you. Um, I can't remember who it was for. Um, New York. Is uh, it J.P. Morgan? Yeah, that's it. Like, what is that? Like that sort of thing, yeah, it probably was very good in the 1930s, but not now. Honestly, to me, like some people might like it, but to me personally, that is an eyesore. It takes up a, a full city block. 
It just, honestly, it just does not work. Uh, Adib, welcome to the stream. Good to have you. I was just showing a Art Deco building that's going up in New York at the minute. And it just doesn't work. <laughs> I've lost the picture of using there, so... I mean, the thing is, that building was designed by Lord Foster. He normally does good buildings. To me, that won't fit in the way New York is. No. It would fit in the 1920s, but not the 2020s. just horrible Lord Foster had too many Fosters <laughs> he's from Stockport he's a local lad We end in the stream at 12. The reason I say that is because I'm working tomorrow, otherwise, I'd go on for longer. So there's a bit of an angle. So if this is the top of the roof, then that goes up and around. Up and around and there's a bit of a cap. Um, I'm surprised WWE haven't muted the crowd tonight. I heard FU Roman a few times. We're British, it's what we do. <laughs> Our fans are just the best at wrestling events. I can't think what it's going to be like at All In next month. I am actually going to All In. I 
Odin proed. I'll say we do it. <laughs> on that one as well, isn't it? Very brave to do, for AEW to do Wembley for the first British show. Well, apparently they wanted to do Craven Cottage, but there was some, like, like permission issue from the council, I think. Like, they couldn't, they couldn't get the permit. Obviously, with Wembley hosting big events anyway, then it sort of made sense. I will say, getting 65,000 for your first wrestling event at Wembley, that's definitely some going. So I'll give props to AEW for that. I'm back. You're right, Ross. I didn't even realise you'd gone. <laughs> Nobody tells me nothing. Uh, Max was saying that WrestleMania could be coming to Wembley, apparently. I know they're hosting All In in August, and I'm going. So, um, okay. Oh, I'm yet to see when Wickham win at the new Wembley in person. Only time I've seen them win there was in COVID season. I've got a hundred percent record at Wembley. Mind you, I've only been once. <laughs> I've only been to Wembley once, I suck.
bug. I didn't mean to do that. But I can make it work. Uh, I've got a hundred. Ross was looking for roof trusses. <laughs> Oh yeah, Ross. I didn't. I didn't know if you were in the stream when I've sussed it out, but it turned out I'd actually forgotten to put a truss in. So that's what the issue was. Um, I've got a hundred percent record Wembley. Just never saw again. So that's a zero percent record then, <laughs> or not applicable. It took me a bit of time to suss it out, but that was actually what I'd, what I'd done, or rather, not done. I forgot to put a truss in that affected both sides. But I did say beforehand, the slightest mistake at this scale, at this scale can cost you. I, I didn't even know anybody had left. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, 
24. to there it's all glass behind it so too far on that. Listening to the crystal method. Keep hope alive. There we go. You can see now exactly what I'm listening to. wondering where your playlist was <laughs> I was gonna say should I have it showing on most streams and then people know what I'm listening to or are you all good
Right, so that's the glass for that. Where's the tab are we using? That's it. Um, right, so then the white bit goes down to the end of that first segment, isn't it? So. Slightly wrong with that. And I think the trusses carry on down, don't they? So suss that out. In terms of the back wall, I think they so they go in at an angle as well. Hang on, are they? Are they windows or have they sort of boarded them up? I'll leave them as windows for now, but I think they might have actually been boarded up. Um, hmm. Either way, the back wall is going to be where the top of this is, so... That's... Three, four, five, so that's right.
Guessing they've been boarded up. Yeah, I think they have. I mean, that picture I was looking at was probably taken around 1992. It's definitely early 90s. So it's entirely possible they were boarded up. Decided I'm going to end the stream actually in the next 10 minutes. So it's a 10 minute warning. So it is getting on a bit now, so. still on yeah I'll be going off in the next 10 minutes or so because I'm working tomorrow then I'm gonna be up relatively early on Monday as well I'm presuming you're working tomorrow as well. Any overtime shifts? No. Having a bit of a meet up on Monday morning. Not sure yet what time I'm still going to find out. Uh, yeah, 7 to one thirty, And then 5.12 Monday. Ah, fair enough. I could probably be on Monday night if you want. Seven AM start on Sunday, yeah. I've got a walk to work tomorrow because the bleeding Iron Man event is on. So they've closed half the roads. I've got a work I've got a walk to work which should probably take me about an hour, hour and a half. Yeah, sounds fun, doesn't it? And yeah, sure, mate, sounds like a plan. No worries. What time would you want to go on? Yeah, 
that's a long walk. Yeah. I've done it hundreds of times before though. Monday about 11ish if you want. Yeah, that's fine. Then for Christmas then? Yeah, I will be. Obviously I don't know what date she had because it's ages off. cold by then yeah still I'd rather it be cold than absolutely boiling Okay, where these things are going. And then I'll be wrapping up. weather in my knees and hip don't mix. Nah, that's understandable. It's the only downside with it because you have it with your joints. Six, seven, eight, nine, so that's right. When are you next live? I'll be next live on Tuesday. Might do some more on Wigan. Or I might put a poll up again and see what you guys want. build any old Trafford off stream um, well I'll be doing a specific old Trafford 
but <laughs> no, I, I might do a bit off stream. I don't know. I'll probably try and rejig that corner actually and get that properly sorted out. And then I think maybe on Monday I'll put a, a poll up and see what everybody wants me to stream on Tuesday. And we'll see where we're at. It wouldn't surprise me if Old Trafford got most votes again. It's only one column on that one. Giovanni Brown to Bristol Rovers, yeah, I saw that. Right. That's just uh, what I want to do. So I think I'm going to call it there tonight. Uh, it's been eventful. All the parts have been boring. Um, when we do the Ashton Gate changing rooms, when I get chance, I can't say when that's going to be yet. Uh, mainly because of the amount of stuff I've got going so we'll just see what happens um, but yeah other than that I think it's been good tonight um, thank you to everybody who's been commenting, liking I don't know how many likes we're on four, that's alright I'm happy with that um, so yeah thank you to everybody who's joined, commented I would say subbed but no one has and liked and then yeah I'll put the poll up on Tuesday on no sorry I'll put the poll up on Monday and see what you guys want me to stream and then we'll go from there so that's going to be it for me guys thank you very much for joining and I will see you all 